Yo guys, Evan here, or Grumpy Gorilla, whatever you want to call me, and today I'm going to be teaching you how to play dart. I got my dart here. I have got great button ones as well, but I'm using these because I can't find the great button ones. So, we are going to teach you how to play dart. So, I'm going to have a go of throwing the darts first to show you how kind of good I am. I'm not that good, but... Yeah, who cares? Um, leave a like and subscribe if you're new. I'll throw them th first, and I'm gonna teach you how to put your dart together, and you know, and um, put everything together and how to hold it. So, I'm just gonna come by here and just kind of aim. Right there. So, as you see, the darts are on the board. You might not see all of it because they're light, but they're on the board. So, yeah. So, the next thing I'm going to get, you want to make sure when you get the darts down, you can't just go, like, grab them at both at once because you're going to wreck the darts. You want to grab them one by one and grab them maybe the tops of the grips, like, just to, you know... And if you're not tall enough, ask your parents. So you want to grab them about maybe there to there when you can get them off the board. So I'm going to lay my darts here right now. And then I'm going to show you one of my group one ones. And we're going to come by here. No, that's too low down. Okay. So we're going to come down by here. Take that off. Lay over there. Um, unscrew these. And teach you how to put the dart together. Wow. So, basically, you got these first. You want to connect these together. As you see, there's a hole right there. That's a bit dirty, I know. But there's a hole right there. And, as you see, just screws on. Pick, before you do this, Pick the darts what weight, like, I got a lightweight darts, but if you think you're really confident and you want heavyweight darts, just, I would try lightweight darts first so you can get comfortable, but then go on to heavy ones, so, yeah, and as you see, screw, it's going to screw the top, and if you know the, like, kind of... If you know the connection kind of thing, or whatever it's called, righty tighty left loosey. So, if I turn it right now, if I turn it right, just cleanly screws on. And then you've got to make sure it's screwed on till it's not turning. So look, as you see mine, mine's really tight. It won't turn. So, next part is... You, I keep the covers on till you do the darts actually that's what I've got to say but the next part is if you can see they got like little gaps in them so if I go like if I show you they have got little gaps in them as you see and here's the flight that's what they're called that's the stem I think that's the grip that's the point that's what I call it and this is a flight and as you see right here you got the like this part goes out and then you got dips in the middle well see where the gaps are you want to stick these out kind of parts in the gaps like that so it's nice and on and you want to make sure every single part so every single dip in the middle they all got like the stem parts on so the next thing is you want to make sure they're on properly and they're ready to go which mine when I throw them they fall off but you want to make sure they're on if they break probably use sellotape I'm not sure make sure because if I go like that let me take it off for a sec your um your flight will um start off flat like that like really flat and what you want to do is, because mine are all connected, you want to just go like that. So like that, like from like that, from flat, and then you want to just go like that. Fold them kind of thing, like, so they touch like that. 
because then your dart will be like a cross and that's that's what you want so that's the explaining done for how to put a dart together and as you see mine is successfully together so yeah and right here we got um, you know we got the, um, my darts now and before you even throw them you don't want to hold them wrong because this is what happens if I hold them by the stem I'm going to show you it don't go anywhere so you want to because look if I if I do the stem you're not getting enough power to get on the board so what you want to do is see the little grippy kind of part there you want to I hold it like up here that's why I don't hit the board a lot but you should I'm hold them there and then I put my finger like above here so I have a nice grip on it and it's all I you want don't want to hold it tight or you don't want to go like that because this is what happens when you go like that already hold on it's gonna bounce it will bounce that's just luck but it's not going to go on properly and it's gonna bounce and either hit your face or something and nobody wants a dart like that stuck in your face so basically you want to make sure you hold it properly and don't throw it so hard you want to just maybe just go like that straight kind of arm like you want to keep your arms straight and just go maybe bend it back a little bit and go like that so what i'm going to do right now is i'm going to turn the camera around so you can see me while you're throwing them and see my arm so sorry about the light so let me go get my darts so right now as you see i got them right now i hold them like that so if i go a bit forward you want one foot your most preferred foot forward and one foot like back you want to be standing sideways and you want to go like that you can't turn your whole body because it will make it look a bit weird so you want to like kind of turn your body so my stomach and the chest is facing the wall to be exact and then you want to pull your arm out like that bend it a little bit and when you're throwing it you want to kind of straighten it so like that but you want to put power on it so like that and then if you want to put power on it just go like that and then go when you're ready do little ones and then go I put mine all the way back there but it actually hits the board successfully so I'll do it again I do it fast ready I'll do it fast and I hit the board successfully so I'm gonna go through now it so I'm literally gonna go through it by doing I'm gonna go just show you how I do it now and the green I just want to admit I think I've told you this but the green part in the middle is 25 points and the red part in the middle is bullseye which is 50 points so So I'm going to get my darts and I'm going to turn the camera back around so you can see and look at this. This is what you get when you follow the rules successfully. Sometimes it might fall off the board because you don't have enough power but that is what you get successfully. So I think I want to admit, I think the middles, the middle outline is triples. I'm not 100% sure, I think triples is red, green is doubles. So I'm going to show you one last time how to throw it, then I'll end it off. So I'm going to throw one more time I meant. 
and you want to kind of you want to kind of, as you see, my darts are mostly together. Like right, there's one there, one there, and one behind. And you just want to make sure they're together. Because what I do is you've got to aim them at the right position. It won't bounce off because it'll go by the side of the dart. So you want to get your darts close together as well. So that's it. So guys... Basically, that's all the rules for darts, playing darts. Maybe versus your parents to learn a bit more. Or versus one of your friends. Practice makes perfect. So, guys, if you enjoyed this little tutorial how to play darts, then leave a like on this video and subscribe if you are new. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace!